Continue to track Hurricane Dorian. The Category 1 storm is slowly making its way up the eastern seaboard after making landfall this morning in North Carolina. Dorian pounded parts of the Outer Banks with strong winds and torrential rain. The storm surge from the Category 1 storm swamped the Outer Banks. Look at those waves coming in, causing significant damage, flooding entire neighborhoods as we see there, and they're cut off as well. The rising floodwaters trap people in their homes on Ocracoke Island. The governor says crews are are standing by and ready to head there to begin the rescues. Officials say more than 370,000 people are in the dark and thousands more could lose power as Dorian moves up the eastern seaboard. In the meantime, now a Royal Caribbean cruise ship docked in the Bahamas today to deliver much needed supplies that Dorian demolished homes and obliterated some infrastructure as it hit the islands as a category five storm. The storm is blamed for at least 30 deaths across the Bahamas and that number is expected to rise. Coast Guard rescued more than 200 people yesterday and is continuing operations today.